It's time now for the award-winning number one local talk show in Northeast Pennsylvania, The Sam LaSant Show. Now here's your host, Sam LaSant. My friends, I'm inviting all of you, I'm inviting every one of you to a great party we're going to have October 20th at the Mohegan Sun. Yes, it's going to be a great time. If you haven't been there for this event, you're going to want to go October 20th at the Mohegan Sun. What is it? It's the Better Living Showcase that's presented by Time Shamrock. Uh, I'm one of the speakers along with some great things that are happening. Uh, I'm joined today by my co-host, John Patton, uh, who wants my job and he certainly can have it. Um, but you see, John, you have, to be, you have to be handsome, you have to have a personality, Ugh. you know what I mean, to do yeah. the show. And you don't, you don't qualify. Well, I got a lot, of, a lot of time ahead of me to get to where you are, so. <laughs> well, John, thanks for coming on the show. John is the uh, operation manager for our media partners, the standard speaker. I, um, uh, when Paul Ross called me and said, you know, would you be willing to speak again? Uh, I, I said, absolutely. Uh, because we had a great time last year at the Mohegan Sun, John. Uh, and there's a lot of great things. Um, it's called a better living mm -hmm. showcase. Okay. Talk about it. Well, I think it's a great, it, it obviously it's another one of, of the abilities that we have is to get all the, our Northeastern Pennsylvania assets together in one place. And, and Mohegan Sun's a great place for it. Uh, but it, it brings together uh, stuff that, that people are interested in. I mean, obviously there's health stuff. There. Those are the kind of things that, that maybe people have questions about. And we try and get them all in one place at one time. Um, so we have people with representatives co from Coordinated Health and from Commonwealth Health and from Guy Singer. They're all on different topics. So topics that are of interest to people, um, you know, that maybe they need answers for and they can get them all in one place at one time. You have an opportunity to, you know, if, to visit various uh, seminars that the doctors put on. Because sometimes people have concerns, John, about, you know, different things. And I'm looking here, whether it's arthritis, uh, bone health, um, nursing home, uh, marijuana program. Mm -hmm. There's all this interesting information that they have at the different seminars. And folks, you'll see them in the paper. They have the, you have the schedules in the paper. Absolutely. Um, now... When when someone goes there, okay, it's at the Mohegan Sun. When does it start? It uh, so it, it starts at at nine thirty, and then there'll be the opening remarks. I'll be the MC up there. I'm I'm working oh, my man. way. I'm working my way into your job. Oh, so I'm wow. I'm trying to take these gigs wherever I could get them. <laughs> uh, but it starts at nine thirty, and if you pre-register, there's some you know if you you, you, you can take a look at it. You, you, we have a chance to win a hundred dollars in in, uh, in Pennsylvania lottery tickets, but. It, it's all day. I think what happens is, Sam, and in a lot of these cases is sometimes you go to this thing and you find out something that you weren't even expecting to find out. And and so we have these side rooms available and they're topics of, of interest that maybe when you got there you didn't have an interest, but when you saw it uh, or you saw it in the paper, you said, hey, this is something I want to attend and maybe you're going to find out something that is, is very helpful to you, but you weren't even sure you were looking for when you went up there. Yeah, and, and that's what I'm saying is that when, when you look at the different uh, exhibits that they're having, joint and back pain, um, answers to the most common asked retirement planning questions. Absolutely. Okay, the next segment, well, after we go for a break, uh, we're going to talk to Anthony Cirillo. And folks, Anthony Cirillo is a fabulous person. Um, you'll see the interview I did with him. Uh, he is a, a, an aging uh, expert. Uh, he uh, gives seminars. He also sings, so uh, this uh, and he'll talk about it when I when I play the segment I, I recorded with him, uh, <clears throat> and he's going to be on, I think at um, uh, one thirty, correct? Yep. He'll be on uh, and and yeah. before him, there's a great speaker, handsome guy, knows what he's talking about. That's me. I'm on uh, on from uh, is it uh, twelve thirty to twelve thirty one? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm on a 12:45 uh, to 1:30, uh, and but it's going to be a fun time. Now my talk is now listen to this. <clears throat> Even John's going to be impressed with this. Some ways to live longer and healthier via the media. Okay, that's all I'm going to say to you. But it's going to it's interesting. I've been working on this for a while. Uh, putting all my years of experience via the media, which we're in. Absolutely. Okay, um, John. The day. How do you, so? Looking at the day, um, you have 9:30. They register. <clears throat> what are some of the key um, 
exhibitors that are going to be there. Well, I think coordinated, coordinated will be up there. So what they have is they have a main ballroom, and there'll be exhibitors in the ballroom, and I'm, I'm sure you guys will, will uh, be able to, to get a look at that. But in the paper, we'll have a list of the exhibitors that will have just booths there for you to attend. But then there'll be side rooms that you can go to. There's three different side rooms that you're going to be able to to go to and and, uh, and find out, again, some of the topics uh, that are of interest to you. You can just go in there, you can register, and you can go in and you can talk about bone health, you know, or you could talk about the marijuana side of it. You know, there is, there's going to be a, a speaker on that as well. So there's there's something for everybody. And as, as I get closer to retirement age, I know you're not quite yet there, no, no, I but as I get close to it, these are, these are things that are of <laughs> interest and it's never too early to start looking at these things whether it's the the healthcare side of it or even the financial side the planning side of it of uh, you know from a retirement because the last thing you want to do is get to a point where you're ready to retire but you're not you're not sure what to do the interesting thing about this is um, well there's a lot of interesting things but when I'm looking at the exhibitors for example they have a diet and exercise exhibit mm -hmm. you have senior living uh, the hospice of the Sacred Heart will be there you have um, Travel world, you, you have um, travel and rec medical products, wealth management, home improvement. It seems like it covers estate planning. It covers everything. Absolutely, and and well, that's one of the things too. When you talk about travel, travel world being there, it's you know sometimes people real don't realize that you know travel can really help your health out. So again, maybe when you go, sometimes where you go, but when you go, uh, you know certainly you know those those are the type of things that can help you uh, you know maybe live a longer, happier life. The Showcase, folks, it starts at 9.30, and it's at the Mohegan Sun. And this is open at all ages, yep, right? Okay. absolutely. Because it's yep. called Better Living Showcase. Sure, and, and you know, sometimes it might be the, 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 the adult or the parent might want to bring a, you know, a, a child along with them, and the child might be 40 years old because the parent might be 60s. And there's something for everybody. It's something that you can learn um, you know, as you go through this thing. There is going to be, I, I tell you that I went last year, and I was amazed by the amount of things that there are for people to do there. Stuff that you may not have even thought about, you're gonna get a chance to think about or at least find out about it. And then maybe go forward after this is over and, and, and build on what you've learned. How did this thing better the Living Showcase come about? How well, it's another one of the events that, that uh, the Times Chamberlain you know, family has uh, kind of put together. And it's one of those things that is, is pertinent to people. And we have the the ability to put this together to go you know throughout northeastern pennsylvania and grab people from all over the area to go to a place like mohegan where a lot of people go anyway uh, but this is another event that we've put together that really brings the community together and gives them information that they can use to make their lives better i'm excited about it i told paul ross the same thing i said paul i said i'm really excited and rebecca uh at the very very nice person yep. well they're all nice except maybe you know the hazelton person like you but we'll work on that I'll okay. see what I can do. So, yeah. Overview of the event. It's held at Mohegan Sun, free parking, register in advance to win $100 in Pennsylvania lottery tickets. The door prize is drawn every hour. Now, when we come back, folks, we're gonna, you're gonna, I did an interview with uh, Anthony Cirillo. The guy is fantastic. He really is. Uh, and you'll see you from the interview. We'll be back with Anthony right after these messages. Well, welcome back to the Sam LaSanne Show, folks. Remember, 24-7, you'd watch all of our programming on ssptv.com all over the world. Uh, a lot of people uh, who are friends of mine in um, uh, Poland and also in Italy have been watching our programs, and it's very exciting. Well, you know, we have John Patton on the show, but now at this event, I told you, which is October 20th, Mohegan Sun, uh, Better Living, put on by the Tam Sham Tam Shamrock, uh, there's a lot of activities as we talked about and we're going to continue to talk about one of the but mo one of the most important things I think that you find are very interesting is the speaker they have uh, the main speaker other than me other than me uh, Anthony Cirillo uh, he is a healthcare professional it's and he's very it's very interesting I have Anthony on the phone now uh, and he's looking forward to coming on Anthony thanks for coming on the show Oh, thanks for having me. Okay. Pleasure. Now you you are you you have a lot of stuff to see. We're talking, folks, before we we uh, tape this segment. Uh, uh, tell me a little bit about yourself, Anthony. Yeah. So uh, so I'm a paisano from uh, South Philadelphia originally, and um, I've been in uh, broadcasting and healthcare for uh, many many years, and um, worked in the Philadelphia area before moving to New York and. Uh, 
working with a company that worked with seniors and then coming down to the Charlotte, North Carolina area. So, you know, while I was a healthcare professional, at night I was also a full-time uh, musician playing in uh, bands and, you know, nightclubs and some of the casinos in Atlantic City and, uh, you know, gone and recorded uh, in Nashville. But one of the interesting things is when I got out of all of that, um, I started going into senior care homes. And, uh, you know, one, in fact, is up in, uh, up in Forest City. Uh, we, have a, we have a place up in the Endless Mountains. And so I started entertaining seniors, uh, and this was some 20-something years ago. And when I left Philadelphia, I was doing 100 performances uh, part-time, uh, and uh, it soon uh, became apparent that I was getting a lot of fulfillment out of it, and I was also giving a lot of fulfillment. So, uh, you know, the way I spend my days is... Uh, I do still work in healthcare um, uh, right now, particularly working with caregivers and with companies to bring them caregiver solutions to help their employees and also to healthcare providers. Uh, I, uh, I also write for U.S. News and World Report. I'm on a local uh, version of the Today Show here in Charlotte every month. And uh, obviously, I'm a speaker and I use song in all of my uh, um, keynotes, and, and that's what we'll be doing at Mohegan. And uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's not going to be one of my, you know, when I'm talking to healthcare professionals, the blah, 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 PowerPoint thing. Uh, it's going to be a lot more entertaining and interactive, so we're going to have some fun. You know, it's, uh, this event that the Time Shamrock puts on every year is extremely interesting because they have various doctors in different um, uh, areas that people can learn about and um, I my uh, talk is going to be on how the media could um, extend your life a little bit but anyway let me get back to what you're saying folks there are some areas um, uh, I highly recommend that if you can make it on October 20th to come to the event uh, there's a lot of activities happening um, I'm on 11 uh, 12 30 and then Anthony comes on at uh, 1 15 but however Anthony so when you're talking about caregiver solutions okay uh, I know many people who are caregivers and boy, they could use all the help that they can. How, uh, for those who maybe cannot make the event, uh, how could they get some of this information from you uh, learning about caregiving and about some of the um, health care uh, areas that they could, you know, improve upon? Sure. Uh, well, they certainly can go to my website. It's um, theagingexperience.com. And, um, you know, I could tell you, uh, if anybody wants to get in contact with me, I'd be glad to tell them. You know, what we have is a set of solutions that we bring to companies, uh, but we really hope that employees will advocate with their employers to bring these solutions to their companies because, uh, you know, caregivers a lot of times are shunned in the workplace, and it's an unfortunate thing, but some of the culture is changing around that, and, and uh you know, we hope to have more employees, and we have five and a half million people under our caregiver services right now that are availing themselves of, of, of what we offer, which includes, you know, real people that you can get on the phone and can uh, work with you through your whole caregiving journey as well as a, a wealth of information. Um, if people want to just get their feet wet a little bit, I also run something called a Caregiver Summit. It's um, www.caregiversummit.org. And what we do is we have uh, videotaped interviews with experts in the field, short 10- to 15-minute video clips, and we discuss uh, all aspects of caregiving uh, from, and we have 12 categories, from becoming a caregiver uh, to after the caregiving is over. So a lot of good information just on that site, and our third summit goes live November 1st. And then, of course, um, you know, if you just get in touch with me, I could tell you more about the other things that, that, that we offer. Or, or better yet, come to Pocono on, uh, on October 20th, and uh, I believe I have a table that will be set up, and you could uh, sit and talk to me, and I'll be glad to cover it. Uh, how long have you been doing this, Anthony? Well, I've been in healthcare. Um, not my first hospital job was in 85, so that should tell you uh, okay. all you yeah. need to know. I'm a, a fellow in the American College of Healthcare Executives, and... Uh, you know, been in healthcare most of my life, preceded by, you know, like I said, a little bit in broadcasting and uh, a little bit in medical publishing. Um, what can I expect from you uh, when I go to the uh, Mohegan Sun on October 20th? Yeah, well, uh, I am so presumptuous that I am going to present a, t a program called The Meaning of Life. <laughs> so there you go. Good. You're going to find The Meaning of Life in an hour. Who knew? Yeah. But, you know, here's the thing. With those thousands of performances I've done with seniors, 
uh, and especially the ones, you know, who are in the nursing homes, you know, where you think, there for the grace of God, go I. They have so much to tell us and teach us if we'd only kind of listen to them. And so I've learned eight points that we all know, but we very seldom uh, practice every day in our lives. And, you know, I'll just go through some of them, like the, having purpose in your life. I mean, I could tell you stories and will tell stories about residents in these places that I go and sing who have incredible purpose when you think that their life is over. Uh, you know, I had one woman say, you know, I pray to God every day for what my purpose is, you know, things like that. You know, how uh, staying active helps them and having a sense of humor. And uh, and one of the ones I'm writing in uh, in the November U.S. News and World Report is all about gratitude. You know, I think one of the big things I've learned from seniors is how grateful they are for things, no matter their circumstance. So essentially every point that I make and say to them is going to have a story of a wonderful person I've met uh, along the way, uh, including some from northeast Pennsylvania. And then um, we're going to we do a little snippet of a song, and then uh, every point that I make has some research and science behind it. So there's going to be some poignant moments where people might be uh, make sure it's here too when they hear a story, and there's others where uh, they're going to be flapping their wings and tweeting like a bird uh, when I do the point of humor and uh, let their hair down. And uh, of course, we have prizes uh, for the best. I call them the tweeters and the flappers. Okay, so what I didn't tell you was I had my own orchestra when I was um, in high school and college uh, called the Lancers, and I played trumpet. Uh, and of course. So anyway, um, I don't want to upstage you to sing because then everyone wants to hear, hear me instead of you, and I won't do that to you, okay? But anyway, <laughs> anyway, uh, you know, Sinatra, Dean Martin, all these, you know, so I, you know, uh, we have a lot of fun with that. But uh, certainly we're looking forward to seeing you, Anthony, and uh, hopefully, uh, uh, you know, with a little bit what I have to say and a little bit what you have to say, uh, in fact, you have a lot to say, uh, will be, it'll be a, a great uh, opportunity for people to, um, to come there to learn a lot. So uh, I'm looking forward to seeing you, and thanks so much for taking the time today and doing this segment uh, on the, the Sam LaSanne Show. Remember, if you want to see it, Anthony, you can just go to our website, which is ssptv.com. Uh, hit shows, you see the Sam LaSanne Show, and this will, be, this will be up at the end of the week uh, so you can see how well you did on the show. There you go. Okay. We could have a vocal, uh, like a vocal competition, like The Voice. <laughs> well, uh, we have a lot of fun. You know, it's, it's 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 a lot of fun, and that's what it's all about: keep keeping keeping people happy and uh, looking at the the best things in life. Uh, so, and you are a grandfather, right? Of six, yes. Well, that's good. I'm a grandfather three, three uh, through nineteen. It's good, good. I'm a grandfather of three, sixteen, fifteen, and fourteen. Okay, so it's uh, uh, it's a lot wow. of fun. Uh, nice talking with you, Anthony, and we'll see you October 20th, okay? See you soon, Sam. Okay, so folks, I'm talking to Anthony Cirillo. He's going to be uh, the main speaker uh, at the Mohegan Sun uh, October 20th. As I said, there's a lot going on, and John and I are going to be talking. And we've already talked a little bit, but we're going to talk a little bit more about it when we come back after the break. But remember... Uh, Try to make it. it. It'll be very interesting, and hopefully, um, it's interesting. My talk on on how the uh, media could extend your life a little bit, and that's going to be interesting for. Um, uh, I hopefully uh, with with Anthony's uh, meaning of life and what we have, we, we can leave there very excited and very uh, enthused about life. We'll be back right after this. Thanks for staying with us, folks. Wasn't that a fabulous interview with Anthony Cirillo? Uh, and he'll be there at the Mohegan Sun, uh, October 20th. Uh, he'll be uh, making his presentation. Right before him, I'll be doing my uh, presentation. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, in case you just tune in, I'm here with John Patton, who wants my job, and he certainly can have it, uh, uh, who is the operation manager or media partners of the um, uh, Standard Speaker. John, once again, for those who are just tuning in, this uh, Better Living Showcase, October 20th at the Mohegan Sun, what can we expect? I think, day? well, first of all, I mean, we'd like you to pre-register, and we told you that we would we would give you that, and it's we'll, we'll give you that website in just a second. But pre-register, you can take a look at everything that's, that's available to you. Uh, there's a lot of health-related stuff. There's a lot of retirement planning stuff. Those are the kind of things that, 
it's never too early to start looking at this. And there's something for everybody. I mean, you know, we're going to have, you know, we'll have door prizes every hour. We're going to give something away. Uh, we're going to end up with a trip for two to Ireland. You got to be there. You got to be present to win it, but then we're going to give away a trip to Ireland. So from that standpoint, obviously that's great, but all the information that you're going to be able to get someone like you, someone like Anthony, someone in the, in one of the breakout rooms that's going to talk about some of the, the things that are of interest to people. You don't need to attend them all. Uh, but certainly you, you, everyone will be able to find something that's of interest to them to, you know, to go to. Uh, there's just a whole mess of stuff here. Yeah, yeah and I, 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 you know, I think the key is that everyone's going to find something of interest to them. Uh, and, and so it's going to be a, an informational time. I mean, there's, there's kiosks, or there's going to be booths set up for people. There, you know, we'll have the, the, um, the list of all the, the people that are going to be there. But again, then there'll be separate people from Coordinated or from Geisinger, from uh, uh, Commonwealth that'll be doing separate topics. Um, and so you can take a look at what it is that, that you're interested in and there might be something, like I said earlier, that you're not even sure you were interested in. You go in and you find something out that's going to be helpful to you. Anything you pick up here is going to make you know, your life a little bit better. And, and that's what this is all about. You, you know, uh, the interesting thing is when I was there last year, okay, um, I saw the, the, the various uh, seminars, the uh, doctors. But the people who are coming there, are, are, one of them said to me, said, you know, Sam, there's an opportunity where I could at least talk to the doctor, okay, and, and so I have questions. So how many people will pick up a phone and I have a, a concern with my joint? Well, right. what the doctors are busy, but here all these doctors are there, mm -hmm. uh, and then you have all these other uh, opportunities for people to learn, and then you have uh, speakers, okay. I mean, my talk is some ways to live healthier and uh, live healthier and live longer via the media, uh, which I think is gonna be very interesting. But Anthony Cirillo, Folks, you uh, heard the interview. He's fantastic. Uh, he's going to sing along with different things, so it's entertaining. I, I told him, I said, you know, I had an orchestra too. I said, maybe I should do a duet. He says, we, we may sing together. Okay, but then what's going to happen? Then they, they're going to want to hear me and not him. I better not do that. Too. Right, that's probably better. It's probably better. It would be a lot like if you and I were together. <laughs> so, but, it, you know, the, the good part about this is it's a fun day. It is. I mean, it, it's it going to be a good. Yeah. But the other thing which is important too is, you there, we don't see a lot of these situations where you're going to get different doctors of you know different uh, you know uh, specialties in one place. Where if you have a seven or eight different questions, you might be able to hit seven or eight different people and get them all answered at one time. I think it's I, I'm telling you, it's fantastic. A lot of fun. I, I opened a show saying uh, <clears throat> you're all invited to have a big party with us October 20th. Uh, it's presented by Time Shamrock. I think it's a fabulous thing that they do, uh, <clears throat> providing a service. I'm hoping that you're going there. John is the master of ceremonies. I'm sorry to tell you that, but he'll do all right, right? Yeah. <laughs> Again, I'm working my way up to that chair. Okay. Well, you could have this chair. <laughs> tell everyone at um, Time Shamrock I said hi, especially my friend Paul Ross. Absolutely. How's Mr. Farley? Doing well. Is he behaving? He is. Good, good. We'll see you October 20th. Mohegan Sun. Don't forget, pre-register timeshamrockevents.com.